I've seen this sort of thing happen far too often here on the Great Lakes. Human tragedy caused by ignorance of the paranormal. Maybe they sailed into the Lake Michigan Triangle. Perhaps they offended a powerful lighthouse ghost. Maybe they incurred a jinx by having a cat or a woman on board, or left in November with a crew of 13. But in any case, these tragic circumstances were as avoidable as they were unfortunate. That's because, in association with Schiffer Publishing of Pennsylvania, I've written Paranormal Great Lakes, an illustrated encyclopedia. Your quick and easy A to Z reference guide to the supernatural on Lakes Huron, Superior, Ontario, Erie, Michigan, and adjacent lakes, ponds, rivers, estuaries, canals, and cemeteries. Within these pages, find all the information you need to make informed, quick decisions about omens and portents, UFOs and space aliens, weird, rather funky weather, curses and bad mojo, ghostly Indian maidens, mermaids and water spirits, lake monsters, and phantom ships and undead sailors. Early critics' reviews of Paranormal Great Lakes are most enthusiastic. Many readers are stampeding to order this invaluable handbook. But you can order safely and conveniently at www.shifferbooks.com www.shifferbooks.com Another poor victim perhaps of the curse of the Chippewa Copper, or the Black Dog of Lake Erie, or even the Marysburg Vortex. Don't let something like this spoil your enjoyment of the Great Lakes. Buy my book, Paranormal Great Lakes, an Illustrated Encyclopedia, and be informed before it's too late.